Hi, my name is Jeremy Browning with MLC CAD Systems. Today, I'm going to show you how to upgrade your SOLIDWORKS Electrical from 2015 to 2016. This will work for any versions prior to 2015, upgrading to 16 as well. First thing we're going to do is I'm going to open up SOLIDWORKS Electrical, and I highly recommend doing an Archive Environment. That's on the File tab and choose Archive Environment. This will back up all of your SQL, all of your projects, all of your symbols, and everything. So fire that off and then choose next. And in 2015, we have the ability to do custom, all objects, anything modified by a user or modified by a user since a specific date. I'm going to choose all objects. This is going to be a complete backup. And I'm going to choose next. I'm going to go ahead and hit finish. And it's going to ask you where you want to put this. I'm, at this point, I'm just going to throw this on the desktop. I'm going to hit save. All right, once that's done, you're going to see a report here letting you know that everything was completed and if there were any failures. You can go ahead and hit finish. Once it's done, you'll see an archive complete window and it'll ask you if you want to open this folder. I'm going to choose yes and I'm going to look at the size of this. Make sure that this is not zero. Make sure that you didn't get an archive compression error. If you did, go ahead and contact us for support. So at this point, I'm going to go ahead and close out of SOLIDWORKS Electrical, and I'm going to go ahead and open up my media for SOLIDWORKS 2016. Recommendation is to start with SP01, not SP0 or SP0.1. Start with the first service pack, the SP1. I'm going to go ahead and go down to the setup.exe. I'm going to right click, and I'm going to choose to run as administrator. I'm going to choose individual on this computer and choose next. Make sure your serial number is in there and choose next. This is going to give you a warning that you currently have SOLIDWORKS Electrical installed and this is the archive environment warning. It's basically letting you know that you need to back up your environment. We've already done that so we're going to go ahead and choose next. We are going to upgrade SOLIDWORKS 2015 to SOLIDWORKS 2016 SP1. This machine actually has SOLIDWORKS installed as well. So if you'll see down here, it has Toolbox and Whole Wizard. You can actually hit Electrical Options, hit Change. It's going to use your current data, collaborative server, and SQL server, and upgrade those. I'm going to go ahead and hit Back to Summary. Now the installation is complete. Again, you're going to get the option to join the Customer Experience Program and to see what's new in the newer version. I'm going to go ahead and choose Remind Me Later and hit Finish. At this point, you're done with the install and you can open up SOLIDWORKS Electrical. You're going to be presented with a data update. Go ahead and hit next and then scroll all the way to the right up here and hit the finish tab. And then go ahead and hit finish. And lastly, it's going to show you what was done in our report and you can go ahead and hit finish. And at this point, you're good to start using SOLIDWORKS Electrical.